Hey everyone, it's Tinkerish, and here's how to use a breadboard in under a minute. A breadboard lets you connect electronics without soldering. Inside, metal strips connect the holes so parts can share power and signals. The side rails are for power, red for positive, blue for ground. The middle has columns of five holes connected vertically. For example, these five holes in rows A through E in column 15 are all linked. The gap in the center keeps the top and bottom separated, perfect for placing chips or buttons. The holes are not connected across the gap. However, these five holes in rows F through J in column 15 are all connected. Each column is isolated from others. Column 20 is not linked with column 19 or 21. Moving on, power rails run along the sides of the breadboard and stay connected across the board's gaps. To build a circuit, the parts must share a column. For example, this LED's short leg or negative leg here in column 10 connects to the resistor in that same column. But if I were to move the resistor down to column 9, the LED turns off and we now have an open circuit and the parts are not connected. 